to now. The beast guarding tomb with the lion's head, the cow's hoof, the leopard's body, the tail like foxes, usually is put outdoors in the side of the gate of tomb chamber, guarding the master of tomb without the invasion from demo. This kind of beast is undoubtedly imagined by the person who sculptures it. The different animal's parts have been skillfully unified, showing the savage, cruel figure of beast which is out at the side, displaying the rich imagination. This clay figurine of chicken's head with colored drawing on pottery is extremely peculiar. With person's body and chicken's head. In Xinjiang, they have unearthed the large scale tomb statue of 12 animals. Up to now, we have this example. It shows that this phenomenon has some meaning. But no matter how, the picture of burial statues with the close relationship of four men's spirit has been preserved wholly in the Muslim in thousands of years. This is probably the nature's good fortune. The countryside grape grain color earthenware jar is part of neck and shoulder carries on the decoration with four groups of designs. Three groups for the irregular grid, inside of which have been highlighted the grain, implicating countryside. A group of irregular wines, grape grain, curled branches and leaves, laden with fruit. These earthenware with novel decorative design and deep life breath is the best of the Xinjiang painted pottery. The painted pottery design in Xinjiang area are mostly the triangle or many kinds of anomalous design, such as triangle, reverse triangle, triangle fed with parallel lines. All of them are the quite common forms. These painted pottery with different forms and varied colors, mostly were the products of 3,000 years ago. The appearance of earthenware was closely linked with the life of people in the ancient times. Before the metal cooking utensils, starch first process of steaming mainly relies on the china. The ceramic Buddhist relic box with colored drawing on pottery, compared with other china, has quite different usage. This whole earthenware looks like a pagoda, and is mainly used for putting the Buddhism clergy's bone ash and the Buddhist relics. The slanting checker patterns filled with the black circles are drawn on its whole body. 
with the sprightly tone, making a unified whole. Three full ceramics cauldrons with colored drawing on pottery, making the background in the black color, and draw the square and the dot in white, green, dark red. This kind of decorative technique, by using dot to make circle, is the style of ancient Iranian sashan. But this kind of colored earthenware, made especially for berries, this kind of custom is exactly the same with the funeral custom in the area of Southern Yellow River. The ceramic coffin with curl grass grain is unearthed in Mali Butanji country in Xinjiang Kuchetan in 1958. Outside the ceramic coffin, it is two layers of decorative design carved. The upper layer is compound grain type of the continual water chestnut and the honeysuckle pattern. The lower layer is curl grass grain. Its carving scale by knife is vigorous, but the line is extremely smooth, displaying the adept carving technique. The earthenware unearthed in Xinjiang Hetian Yutgegan has distinguished characteristic. It generally regards the paste models of person, animal as the decoration, which is lifelike, having the rich life breath. This earthenware's value lies on ingenious union between practical usage and carving art. A figure of local man is carved in the upper part, and his high top cap is the mouth of earthenware. This figure looks like real, with the sharp, dynamic vision. In this man's vision, if it is reluctant to part with, that certainly is reluctant to part with this colorful world. If it is yearning for, that certainly yearns for varied life in the future. These are leisure foods more than a thousand years ago. At that time, the request of people to the flower food was not only delicious taste, but also attractive form. Regardless of the hand making or mold making, each one has its advantage. Flower dessert of floral formula with six petals not only has two flowers bears among the flower petals, but also has the salmon and piso unexpectedly. With lifelike image, two circles of doubt rings flower dessert buckle up. Obviously, the flower cook has absorbed the technique of camp rope. Yuntun, which was popular in the area of Thousand Yellow River in the Chinese Jin Dynasty, involved the stuffed dumpling gradually. As Dai Yan Zhi in Sui Dynasty said, now Yuntun's shape looks like a half of moon, and it is eaten all over the world. Stuffed dumpling spread to the Turfan area during the Tang Dynasty. These are the hats and coats, shoes and socks thousands of years ago. At that time, the understanding of people to cloth not only been restricted in covering the body to maintain warmth, but also had a higher request. These hats and coats, shoes and socks discovered in Xinjiang area, although in different materials, made in varied ways, all have artistic, natural forms, offering the human extremely comfortable eyesight.
China is the hometown of silk fabric products. As early as in the 10th century BC, the Chinese silk had been spread into Egypt. Five centuries BC, they had been transported to Western Europe. Hereafter, Chinese varied kind of textiles had been transited continuously towards the West. So, the ancient business road connecting Chinese and the West is called the Silk Road. In ancient times, Xinjiang was the necessary path of the Silk Road. From there, I nursed the massive textiles as well as the cotton and the hemp, the woolen fabric, were precisely these historical testimonies. Among massive unearthed fabrics, besides the most common ordinary plain cloths, but also some many upscale special fabric mainly in silk woolen. These upscale fabrics have represented the maximum level of textile craft at that time. Not only has the extremely high value for watching, but also has the extremely precious value for researching. Fill the blank in the history of spinning, weaving and printing in China, as well as the craft exchange history of spinning and weaving between China and the West, providing directly with the reliable evidence. This is multicolor floating wire fabric discovered initially in China for the first time. The fabric surface has the effect of needle embroidery. The golden yellow phonics circling the flower 
dancing in the air, with its throat sagging, the long curled tail like vine spreads the wings by the different posture and soaring. The sentence of poet Wen Tingjun in later Tang Dynasty, the auspicious broadcage startles the golden phoenix to fly, may be referred to this kind of grain type. The range of Tianshan Mountain, spanning the middle part of Xinjiang, is the dividing line of northern and southern boundaries. Northern border, although with cold climate, was actually boundless prairie with abundant water and plants, which is always the stage in the history of the nomadic nationality in ancient times, such as Tokharia, Xiongnu, Xianbei, and Vesta Tujue, and so on. At once to freely and quickly, these horsemen moved from place to place in the region of the northern prairie in Europe and Asia, has only left unique vestige of prairie cultural spots. Bronze warrior wearing the hat with curved hook was referred by the academic circles that these race living in the boundary. Also mentioned about the Western ancient times in the literature, it belongs to the ancient European race, which is divided into three collateral branches. One of them is famous as the characteristic wearing peaked, called as the peaked cap nationality living in the boundary. This figure knee on the floor, with the both hands grasping the weapon, resembling preparing and waiting for the battle. The copper cauldron is the cooking utensil commonly used by the prairie nationality on north, and it is widely popular in the Europe and Asia prairie. Because of its thin wall transferring heat quickly, it is especially suitable for roasting the meat in fire. Copper cauldron is very deep, could be added water massively in order to boil much more meat. The prairie nationality takes the herdsman for the man. Living along water plants, moving frequently, thereupon they made copper cooking instruments especially thin and light, convenient for carrying. These large-scale copper wheels unearthed from Xinjiang have the clear local characteristic, a rare all over the country. Many of these copper wheels' appearances are solid color, or only having simple linear, decorative design. Does not notice more decorative design, but can tower. Each kind of piece and characters, regardless of its size, is all accurate in proportion and vivid. This plate, having two copper wheels of standing lines abreast in row, is unique all over the country. Not only quite shadow, having double beads inside, it is unlike the practical daily stuff. This is double animal heads ring-like copper wheel cast by the red copper. 
the double bees face to face, with its ears resembling the double horns curved towards the back, like tiger's shape very much. But its body, resembling the snake, curves to encircle a ring. Similarly, this utensil used by the ancient nationality in Xinjiang was out of the ordinary. It was said that these two bees should be the god believed by the prairie nationality living in the Kunas River basin. The utensil was possibly the religious instrument used in the religious rite at that time. The figure of tiger in this round metal holding up the head, turning the neck, turning around, and not only symmetrical, but also keen, powerful. That is the metal of animal commonly used by the northern prairie nationalities. The gold metal of lion shape also honors from the Alago ruins, with the tiger green gold metal. The modeling looks like the tiger at first sight, but its pate has the thick, long neck here actually. Therefore, it is sought the line by the archaeologists. Murdering lines model to the traditional sign, it shows the cultural characteristic of northern prairie nationality. The golden necklace consisted of four spatial flat tubes folding mutually into the shape of semicircle. Its warning human's neck shows people's noble position and identity. The golden earring ornament in late turquoise is much more novel. It's wholly like being an abstract ox head and its back being loaded the curved red hook used to hang up the ear. These golden ornaments are from different ages or various places, but its processes are all fine, appeared extremely gorgeous, although it is hard to say that whether these gold ornaments were made locally at that time or not. The Artai Mountain and the Arjin Mountain at the north and south of Xinjiang were famous for having gold early in the world. Recollecting the past, massive unbelievable precious cultural relics were unearthed this vast and resourceful region. Overlooking the future, much more historical riddles have been waiting for the people to discover from Xinjiang, where the cultural resource is incomparably rich. We believe the best of cultural relic through millennium in places of thousands of miles must be magnificent music collection remembered by the history of human civilization forever. <laughs>